Hey guys, MP Carlson here, and today I wanted to talk about a little challenge that I came up with in CTR Nitro Fueled. Just this fun little idea that I thought, you know, maybe it could be used for a future Grand Prix. It could definitely work, I just wanted to test it out and see if it would work, and it actually works really well and it's really fun, and I'd encourage any of you who've got the game to try it out. Basically, the challenge is to do an entire lap going the wrong way and still come in first place in a three lap race. Basically what I mean is at the start of the race, turn around and drive in the wrong direction for an entire lap, get back to the finish line, turn around again, and then try and get back up to first place before everyone else finishes. Obviously you can only do this on the tracks that you can actually go backwards on. So that would be Crash Cove, Ruse Tubes, Slide Coliseum, Turbo Track, Coco Park, Tiger Temple, Tiny Arena, Dragon Mines, Inferno Island, and Nina's Nightmare. Those are the only tracks that you can actually go the wrong way on. Because obviously some tracks have ramps and jumps and things like that you can't go backwards on. So I've been testing it out on all of these tracks and I've managed to do it on most of them. Tiny Arena was quite tricky because it's such a long track, but it's definitely doable. Dragon Mines was even harder, but I did manage to do it. Thankfully I realized that on the spiral you can literally just jump down from the top. And I realized afterwards that actually with all the masks that you're probably going to get, you could probably do the minecart shortcut as well. But nevertheless, I did it anyway. The only ones I've yet to do it on are Turbo Track, Tiger Temple, Inferno Island, and Nina's Nightmare. Now Turbo Track, I'm pretty sure is impossible because you get way too far behind. I literally don't think that there is a way to catch up. But I don't know, I could be proven wrong. Okay, well, quick update. I was literally uploading the video and then I checked Twitter and Logical Macrochip was able to do it on TurboTrack and on Hard AI and made it look incredibly easy as well. So obviously I just suck at TurboTrack. This has definitely made me sure that every single one has to be possible then. With Inferno Island and Nina's Nightmare, I'm about 10 seconds out from getting first place. So I do think that's possible if you really, really try. And Tiger Temple, I've been trying for ages and I'm only about five seconds out, but I am certain that it's possible. So I'm gonna set this as a challenge to all of you who have the game, try this out because it's actually quite fun. Not only is it interesting seeing some of the tracks in reverse, seeing what they look like, it's almost like playing an entirely different track, but it's also interesting because you're in eighth place for basically the entire race up until right at the very end. And so obviously you get all the eight place items like war bulbs and clocks and things, and you will need to use them as much as you can to slow everyone else down so that you can catch back up to them. Unfortunately, a lot of that does come down to luck, but most of it is skill based and it is just a fun challenge. And for the most part, it is a very doable challenge because basically what you're doing is completing five laps in the time that it takes everyone else to complete three. Obviously, I would suggest putting the AI on easy. I haven't tried anything above that. I don't, <laughs> don't know if that's possible, but give it a try. Give it a try on all of these tracks. And if you can do it, let me know. Maybe even send me a video or a screenshot on Twitter. I should be able to tell based on the time whether it's legitimate. But yeah, just give it a go. I think it's quite fun. I think it's a very interesting and unique challenge.